James Holder, IFL TV, in association with MTK Global. We're in Leicester today. I'm quite fortunate enough to be joined by English champion Jermaine Smile. How are you doing, right, I'm right. Yeah, I'm good, thanks. Yeah. Good, yeah. good. Firstly, I've got to say, the press conference between you and Dale Williams was fantastic. Yeah, yeah. It was Could have had its own press conference on its own. It was a little bit spicy, a <laughs> yeah. little bit heated at points. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Talk to me about it. No, no, more from his, more from his point. I can see he's a bit worked up and a bit tense, a bit agitated. You know what I mean, but it's all good, isn't it? You know what I mean, like I, I, I was like that at one point um, at, at, at the start of my career, but um, you know what I mean, it's not, it's, it's kind of productive, really, to be honest. Mm -hmm. So wasting unnecessary energy. Mm -hmm. you know what I mean, yeah, you see, there seems to be no love lost between you both. You're very, you're both quite dominant geeters, I expect in life, and yeah. you're both very determined to make the best out of your career. So, it's yeah, a real yeah. interesting crossroad fight for you both. Isn't yeah, it? yeah, it'd be a good fight, but um, too much. I never heard of him. I never heard of him. But the time I heard of him was when um, I won, when I beat Mackenzie, you know Mackenzie, um, he messaged me on Twitter saying we need to speak. So I was like, yeah, we can speak, can I? I never heard of you, but like, who are you actually? I had to go in the box and have a look and see who he is. So I thought, okay, yeah, he's a super middleweight, super middleweight fighter. Uh, I, so I said, we can speak, can I? If, if it's worth it, if it's worth it for me financially and, uh, and worth it for my career, then we, we, we can do it. And here we are. I mean, um, Look, frankly, luckily for him, uh, I think he should be appreciative appreciate that I gave him the opportunity because he's a mandatory challenger. I mean, he's not. I mean, he's um, he's, a, he's, a, he's a voluntary defence for me, not mandatory. Mm -hmm. I mean, obviously he showed no respect today, but um, uh, sometimes you have to kind of make a man respect you by what what you um, what you do to him. Mm -hmm. I mean, what I'm gonna do to him on, on fight night. So <laughs> quite awkward as you said that that will just come walking in. So it's quite yeah, yeah. An awkward moment in itself. Let's, let's talk a little bit about you earning the right to get here. You've been in some real fights. You've worked your way up on the small hall shows. Yeah. Which I think is sort of... The admiration is like underestimated for that. Yeah, yeah. yeah. You might have the, the backing of a big promoter yeah, or a yeah. big network. It's a real hard slog. So yeah, yeah. I know he was involved in the close fight with Leon McKenzie as mm -hmm. well quite recently. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So do you feel like you've earned the right to, to, to move forward in your career for these big fights? Yeah, yeah, de definitely. Um, definitely earned the right. Um, it's all, it's all there on paper. I mean, I've had I've had the hard fights. Um, I've not had I've not had things given to me. I've had to work hard for where I am. Um, I mean, and like we've done it the hard way. No, no one, no one's, no one's put me in any shows. No one's done me any favors. But I've had to work work hard for this. I mean, so definitely I have the right to be where I am. Yeah. What are you like outside the gym? Are you a family man? Talk to me a little bit about your, yeah, yeah, yourself I'm, I'm, as a person. I'm a big family man. I, uh, my family is very important to me. Uh, I've just just had a just had a daughter. She's um, she's one about one and a half. <laughs> she's one and a half. Yeah, a daughter, and, uh, and it, cha it changes your whole aspect of life. You know what I mean? And uh, I'm not I'm not just doing it for me. Me now, I'm doing it doing it for her as well. So um, it gives you that much that that bit more determination to, to succeed and and and, um, and be 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 positive person. I mean, there's big opportunity, obviously. Right? Frank Warren and boxing coming back to this stuff, yeah. coming back to these sides, and no doubt there'll be other shows in surrounding areas. Yeah, yeah. Tonight, but how important is it that you get this stuff and you're involved in these cards for your own personal achievements and career? Definitely. Well, um, for Leicester, I, I want to be down. I, I want to. We're making history here, right? Here. I mean, there's not, there's not been a, there's not been a big major event like this. Like I said earlier, for about 20, 25 years since since Granby Holds was, um, was there, Chris Pyatt was, um, top in the bill. So, so we're making memories. We're making, we're making, we're making, we're making history in Leicester. I mean, like everyone will remember. And um, you see some of these old timers talk about um, going to Granby Holds in 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 the, in, the, in the early 90s or late 80s. Um, but when 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 one of my one of my areas older. They want to be talking. I want to be talking about stories about about Jimmy Smile and about Liam Woodstock and, and CJ. You know what I mean, stuff like that. So, yeah, it's good. I think there's a good crop of fighters. You just mentioned two young talents, yeah. two undefeated young talents. Mm. Put yourself in that mix. Are there other flag carriers for this area, in your opinion? Um, there's not. To be honest, not, not that I can think of. We had, we had, uh, we had. Um, I, I kind of come behind Rendell, Rendell Monroe. Yeah. And, um, boxing bin man. Yeah, yeah, boxing bin man. Yeah, 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 yeah. I come around Randall and Monroe, and 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 there was like a bit of a gap, to be honest with you. There's, there's not really anyone else that's got any decent titles or anything or, or doing much um, apart from me. And, and now we've got we've got we've got these guys coming through, um, Leon Woodstock and um, CJ, 
um, they, they, they can carry on flying the flag. You know what I'm saying? So Especially as they look like R&B stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. They're really carrying on. They look the part, yeah. They look the part. Yeah, they yeah. yeah. Door, <laughs> How do you think the super middleweight division sits at the moment? And where do you feel that, I know you're obviously at English at the moment, yeah. where do you feel you fit in in the grand scale of things? Um, at the minute, I'm, 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 I'm ready to move on. Like, I'm ready to take it to the next level. Like, um, like I say, I, I, I beat my, uh, Markham, defended against, uh, um, what's his name, um, Mackenzie. Um, get this job done on, on April 22nd, and, and I, I, I deserve to move on. I mean, I can't. Fielding a rider of fighting for the British title. Yeah. Is that right? Yeah, yeah, Fielding, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You've got an eye on that? Is that something you're thinking Definitely. about? Definitely. Yeah, that, that, that's, what, that's exactly what I've got my eye on. So, so hopefully, um, after this, um, I can move on, move on, move on to that. Um, like I say, I'm looking, looking to move on. Um, I'm, I'm 30 years old now, you know what I mean? So, like, I, I, I want to get a move on. Like, there's no point in me hanging around here. Uh, I've proved myself at this level now. You know what I mean? It's time, time to move on. Yeah. Credit to you both had Darren Willett for taking this fight. As you yeah. mentioned, it's not mandatory. You guys yeah. have took this, taken this on your own back, yeah, yeah, yeah. which we love. Yeah, yeah. Boxing fans and people that cover boxing yeah, yeah. is brilliant. So, mm -hmm. great uh, contest on the 27th. Yeah. Thank you very much for yeah. TV. Yeah. Cheers, Jermaine. All right, thank you. <laughs>